What's up everyone and welcome to the club. In today's video, I'll show you step by step on how to draw Sonic the Hedgehog. Let's begin today's lesson on the bottom left side of our page and draw an oval for the nose. We're we'll start from the very top, all the way around, and then back up towards the top. Let's add a small oval on the top edge of the nose for a highlight. And it'll fill the bottom area of the nose in black, going around that highlight. Now you want to work our way across the top of the muzzle. Let's start on the top right side of the nose, then it's up, and then down, round up the bottom, and go back up towards the cheek. Let's round up the cheek, and then pull that back in. Let's go back to the bottom of the nose, we're going to curve the chin, coming down, go across, and then up towards the right. Let's add the mouth over on the right side. We're going to start down here, then the mouth going out, and then up. And we'll add a fold across the corner of the mouth. From the left side of the mouth, let's step in, from the bottom of the mouth, coming down, and then up towards that fold. And then along the top, add a curve for the teeth. And then along the bottom, then it's out, and then down from the tongue. Let's fill this inside area in black. Now from here, let's move up and draw the front edge of the brow. From the top of the muzzle, let's step up. It's gonna curl this down, and then bend that up. It's gonna work our way up toward the top of the eye, round this out, come around the side of the eye, and then in on top of the muzzle. Now I'm gonna layer the left brow in behind. We're gonna step down, go out, and then up, bend this up, and then out. Let's tuck the eye in behind that fold. So we'll step back in, come down, and then in on top of the nose. Let's add a thick fold around the brow. On the side of the eye, we're gonna go up, around that fold, and then bend that in. We're also gonna add a thick fold across the top of the right eye. Going up, around, and then down. Now and shift the iris and pupil towards the right side. Let's start on top of the cheek and draw an oval. Going up towards the top, come down, and then back in towards the bottom. Now the left side, we're just going to tuck this in underneath this fold. So start up here, come down, in towards the muzzle, and then back up. Let's trace the iris along the inside, all the way around. Let's add a small circle around the top of the pupil and we'll fill the bottom area for the pupil in black. Now over on the left side, let's trace the inside of the pupil and fill that in. Let's go underneath the chin, add a fold, going out and then up along the side of the head. Now let's go all the way up to the top and draw on the ear. Starting on top of the brow, and bend this up, and then in towards the point, round this out, and down the right side, and then down. Let's trace the ear along the inside. Starting with the left side, going up toward the top, and then down towards the right side. And to close off the bottom with a curve. Now with that ear in place, let's draw the top of the head. We're gonna start on top of the brow, and bend this up, and bend that out in behind the ear. Let's continue that curve over on the right, going out, and we'll bend that down. Let's pull this back in towards the head, and it's in, and then down. Let's add in the second spike. We're gonna step in to create an overlap, going out, bend that all the way down. I'm just gonna pull this back in towards the side. Let's add one more spike. Stepping in, go across, bring that all the way down towards the bottom. Let's go back underneath the chin and add that curve going out towards this point. Go across, and then bend that down. Now let's add in the back ear. Starting on top of the brow, then it's out, and then up. Around at the tip of the ear, 
I'm just gonna bend this back in towards the side of the head. And we'll sign our art and add a splash of color. And that's pretty much it. That's how we draw Sonic the Hedgehog. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. If you did, please make sure you subscribe because I'm posting new lessons every single week. I wanna thank you for watching and I'll see you again soon.